Plays it back to the right side. Botman to the line. Spiza winds up with a shot. Scores! Lucas Spiza from the point makes it 1-0 Anaheim. Eddie Lack, so just a good puck battle right here. Maroon, big body, gets it back to the point. Now Paul Mary, you can see 21 right to the front of the net. And Pogliano there to flip it in. Stanton back for it. Raquel runs into him. Booth runs into Raquel. Winnick winds up with a puck tied up by Jordan Schrader. Having trouble getting it out. Turnover. Valeski with a shot. Never got it through. Gets it back. Scores! Matt Valeski makes it 2-0 Anaheim. Started earlier on with the Koi Vu, but now we're going to see line change. Raquel comes out. Winnick is not going to give up on the puck. Just continue to battle. They keep getting it again right here. Block shot, and then Valeski just continues to go to the... Turns to the forehand. Booth in the corner. Richardson's out front. Cassian doesn't have a shot. Looks for some room. On the backhand, never got it through. Cogliano cut it off. Cassian gets it back to the line. Stanton shot. Save. They score! Oh! That line does it again. It's 2-1. Through it doesn't look like there's much traffic. It's going to go right to the point. Booth is out of the sight line. And I think Anderson was worried about her deflection. Canucks unsuccessful in an early second period power play. Ducks work it in. Here's Bolesky with a shot and lock out the challenge, able to make a save. Trying to win it all Absolutely. with a veteran team and, you know, got rid of some draft picks. Here's a chance out front. Koivu scores! On the backhand, a beauty for Saku Koivu. His 10th of the year and the Ducks make it 3-1. to one. Out of the net. Well, they get on the forecheck first, but then Magliano going to get the puck and quickly throw right to the front of the net. Winnick can't get it, but he knows that Koivu will allow the slap shot, put it wide. Higgins trying to pick it up off the boards, can't. Poke check by Cogliano, and out he comes. Now Perry works it in. Perry back to Koivu, to Perry, backhand pass, cut off, locked down, they score! Corey Perry able to jam it in, it's 4-1 Anaheim. Oh, he can be good off the rush. Corey Perry gets up, he's doing everything well. This one was Cogliano setting up to Perry. And Koivu came off the bench on a line change right there. And instead of firing that one... Wide of the goal. Boschman back. Off the boards. Matthias cut it off. Back to the line of hand. He's over to Garrison. For the one-timer. Didn't miss by much. Daniel got it up front. Anderson down. Somehow able to keep it up. Out of the net as they jammed it on goal. Jensen couldn't put it home. And the Ducks were able to clear. And now we get a whistle. Works it down the wing. Perot with it. Pass to Perot. Out front. Scores! Perot puts it under lack. It is a power play goal. The Ducks take a 5-1 lead. Happens. Here's a shot block right here by Getzlaff. Now it's a two-on-one with Perry and Perot. Now I thought Perot put himself out of the play. I thought he was a little bit too wide. And then when he came in on lack, lack was unsure what was going to happen. He thought he was awfully wide. And now he's going to open up. And Brian Kessler cough it up. Inside 10 seconds to go as the Ducks just retreat to center ice. Watch the final seconds tick off the clock. And the Canucks watch their slim playoff hopes fade even more. Ducks come to town and beat the Canucks by four goals. 5-1 the final score in Vancouver.